And you're grooving over there, huh? Little, little shoulder shimmy. All right, shoulder shimmy. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to throw the shoulder shimmy over to Lara, who has something special for us. What you got, Lara? A little shoulder shimmy. <laughs> and also <laughs> Russell Crowe. He is starring in the first major movie to hit theaters since the beginning of the pandemic, two decades after his blockbuster performance in Gladiator. The Oscar winner spoke to Amy Robach one on one about his new film, Unhinged. My name is Maximus Decimus Meridius. It's been 20 years since Russell Crowe donned armor and a sword as Maximus in the Oscar-winning film Gladiator. And I will have my vengeance in this life or the next. It was 2000 when it came out, 20 okay. years. I've used my body to do my job in a very extreme way. So I carry a lot of injuries from different films, but I'm saying all of this without meaning to sound uh, sad about it anyway. I don't regret any of those decisions. But, you know, uh, at 56, uh, I do feel that on a daily basis. And obviously people will probably always, and in a very good way, associate you with the gladiator role. And you obviously won an Oscar for that role. But I understand that you think you got too much credit for that. Is that true? Ridley Scott is an amazing director. And I do think that you can't possibly give me an award for what I did in that movie unless you recognize the director because he set the tone of all of that. Are you not entertained? Now Crow taking on a new role in the film Unhinged, using his old iconic lines to build excitement. My name is Incidental. I was just mucking around looking for a prop and I happened to walk past that helmet at my place. I thought I would shoot something for my own amusement. And they were like, actually, this is the way we need to, to sell the film. Do not look at him, okay? Crow playing a man whose road rage has made him unhinged. Unhinged is about that normal everyday occurrence where you might have a slight disagreement with somebody about how traffic should flow while you're doing your daily commute. One person's willingness to say they're sorry and the other person's unwillingness to match that. I don't have anything to apologize for, sir. Well, I don't think that's really true of any of us now, is it? It just sets off a series of events which you just <laughs> wouldn't have expected. I don't even think you really know what a bad day is. But you're gonna find out. Your character says, I'm gonna show you what a bad day really is. You're gonna <laughs> learn. <laughs> you're gonna learn the hard way, really the hard way. I think uh, the world has had so many bad days during these times, and this is one of the first movies that people will actually, some people, will be able to return to the theaters to see. Are you excited about that? Well, look, it's the first fresh new thing back. If you've watched everything that you wanted to watch on Netflix, if you've seen The Princess Bride three times, you know, this is the sort of experience that, you know, will shake you up and give you a little bit of fun. For Good Morning America, Amy Robach, ABC News, New York. Thanks, Aim, and Unhinged is in theaters tomorrow. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.